Hello, this is my very first video on YouTube. Now, this is my, uh, now, I'm, now, I am now going to do a walkthrough on Star Wars The Old Republic. First, uh, you start off by creating a new character. I'm going to delete this one currently because, well, well, he was just a practice character. Now, first we are down to the create new character slot. Wait for the screen to come up. Now we pick which one we're going to pick on. I pick. For this video, I'm going to choose uh, the Sith. Now, we start off from the screen by our different choices. In this, we're going to go to the Sith Inquisitor. Now we're going to hit next. Then we're now going to go to this uh, part to choose which um, race we're going to choose. I'm going to choose this class. And then you hit next again. Now we pick a name. I'm just going to pick a random name. As indicated by here. Now we wait for this part to come up. I'll probably cut this scene and if it doesn't end, uh, come up too quick because the loading screens here are known to be much slower. I've or then, like, wow. Now we begin this scene with uh, this cinematic. You do you can't skip this part. You'll have to do it eventually. Or else you can't continue the campaign. one to arrive is finally here. I hope you don't think you're special. It would be a shame if freedom went to your head. Or if you somehow got the idea you didn't need to pass your trials to become Sith. Lord Zash has tasked me with sorting through you refuse to find one worthy of being her apprentice. And I intend to do just that. Give us a chance. We can prove ourselves. We'll just see about that. Now the rest of you gutter trash already know your trial. Get going while I bring our link. Sorry for the low graphics, speed. but I don't have that Watch good of a video card. And don't worry, it'll be all right. He can't kill us all. A Sith fears no one. Suit yourself. Now, slave, for your trial. There's a hermit named Spindrol who lives in the tomb of a Junta Paul in the Valley of the Dark Lords. Spindrol's a lunatic. But Lord Zash sees him as some kind of prophet. Once you find him, he will test you. The more challenging, the better. But there, you know your task. Spindrel lives in the tomb of a Junta Paul in the Valley of the Dark Lords. Don't keep Spindrel waiting, slave. If my gameplay is not that good, I apologize because due to I'm currently well 
Let's just say I'm currently holding a camera in my hand. Now, first, if you purchased the deluxe edition or if you have any in game features, you can go to the mailbox to receive them. As you can see here, I have a few. If you can't read it, the first one says Star Wars The Old Republic Deluxe Edition items, second one, my founder's title, and third one, my legacy pet. The first one, I'll open up. And it comes up with this. First, there's the VIP pass to the VIP lounge. A snapshot ca shot camera. Flare gun, use not that useless. Uh, that useless. And when you get your right first riding, this is a, a rare mount in the game that is only available through deluxe edition. Now that that's complete, I go to the next one. Founder's title. And now the last one, my pet. Alright. Now we go to the inventory. Inventory. And we get our, our title. And these are available for every character once you reach that point. Now you can. Now a good idea is to bind, bind, which you can just go through and just click on this to do. Now we go down. Now we make our way to the tomb of Agenda Paul. These enemies are really easy to kill at the beginning part of the campaign. The Sith want them cleared out, but too many places for them to hide in there. Underworld scum. The best start using our eyes. If they've stolen anything valuable, it'll be your head. Just shut up and fix me. Bottom feeders will be sorry to have stepped on Coraban. Excuse me, Acolyte. Sergeant Corman, 5th Infantry Company, Coraban Regiment. Can I... can I talk to you? Speak freely, Sergeant. Thank you. You're one of the slaves Harkin brought in on the last transport, right? Here to prove yourself to the bloodthirsty overseers? Prove myself or die, apparently. Well, here's your chance to not only show off for the overseers, but start building ties to the Imperial military as well. I'm here commanding a hard target mission to exterminate claw slugs in this tomb. They're horrific things. Mouths bigger than your head. I've lost three squads of good men fighting them. They come in packs. They just... they'll swallow a man whole. Death is merely the final failure of the weak. Yes, sir. But the mission is in danger of failing. Sending more men isn't the answer. The damn claw slugs breed so fast there's no way to wipe them out conventionally. So we started targeting their egg chambers. They went insane. We managed to get explosives to all of the egg chambers, but the claw slugs were all over us before we could detonate them. Sounds like you need some help. Don't underestimate those claw slugs, sir. They're, they're smarter than they look. Now, we'll ha now we head over t to the chambers to take out the claw slugs. And this one, it seems I still have him locked, so... 
I apologize for this part. Now we, now we head up here. As you can see, I just leveled up. Now I add here to detonate the explosives. They don't run so they can't hurt you when they when it explodes. As you can see by there. Now I simply head up, back up. I heard the explosions when you set off the charges. Outstanding, sir. Now, in this, we get to choose from... We get our experience and credits. And an, uh, usually an item, which is usually the what usually happens. Now, not, and earlier you saw me reach level 2. So we can spend those points here. What dark secret shall I share with you? Be and I will now show you the forest lightning real quick before I shut off the video. That's what it looks like pretty much. And I believe that's it for this video. Sorry I couldn't make it longer, but I'm on a certain time schedule. So, well, bye.